Let's go. Oh man. Nothing. Ah! <laughs> new car alert. New car. New, new car alert. Step out the new whip real quick. Guys, think I'm kidding. We got a new car today. Bam, is it mine? No, it is not mine. And what up world? Welcome back to the episode of Skinny's World. You are wondering what the heck is going on. This is my mom's car, actually. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yes, I took um, my mom's car. Why? Because we are at Auto Addict. We are back again with the boys to pick up none other than the Huracan bumper. The new bumper is getting picked today. I'm so excited. Clap it up, clap it up, clap it up. Yes, I'm picking it up. I'm gonna drop it back off, back down in San Diego to get it PPF, bring the bumper and the Huracan back up here to Auto Addict to get it installed. Then we'll be going over to PFS after that, get that mini livery put back on, and we will have the new bumper on the ride, and I am pumped. This vlog is gonna be, it's gonna be an around the way vlog. What I mean by that is, I am not sure about what other parts are gonna show. So my wing has been ordered from 1016. It should be shipping today. There actually might be down the street. I'm actually gonna call James, see if I can pick it up today. If not, it will be being shipped to my house. Hopefully get it in a couple days. My rims are also supposed to be done in a couple days. So all these things are happening all at once and your boy's going on vacation. So your boy is taking a week and a half vacation with the family in Hawaii. So I'm trying to get all these projects in the building before I leave. So when I come back, I can get them installed. Hold on, this truck's coming by. It's busy over here. It's a busy street. <laughs> I'm trying to get all these projects in my hands so when I come back, I can get most of them installed. Without further ado, let's hop inside the auto act. Let's get some of these parts. Let's get this vlog going. You never been here before, huh? No, this not. place is a candy land. So don't it's get it, don't get too excited because you gotta get a supercar, not an American car. But if you get that McLaren that we're trying to push you to get, they might be able to make some parts for you. You really? never know. Never know, man. Welcome, welcome to Cars R Us. Yo. Not Toys R Us, Cars R Us. First time seeing it, what do you yeah. think? It's crazy, huh? Like that yeah, thing looks freaking. Well, it looks like a factory, y'all. Dude, it looks amazing. Dude, when I came here, hi, by the way. What's up? Nice brother? to see you, man. Nice to see you as well. Yeah, man. It's been a minute, but yeah, yeah. finally give you back. Yeah, What's yeah, up, brother? Congrats, congrats on the baby, wow, man. Nice to meet you. This guy Thank had a you. brand I'm new baby. Thank you. Became a father now. Oh my god. Right? <laughs> hey, man. Dad, life is crazy oh, when you have a newborn. Your eyes aren't red, though. I'm surprised. Um, I'm a night owl, so. <laughs> I'm you know, a night owl. There you go. There you go. Dude, newborns are no joke. No. But thing looks dope, huh? Right, dude, dude, look at look look up close. I can't wait to see it on the car, dude. Dude, look up close, like how good like the paint job came out. And the quality of the bumper is oh, freaking so amazing, man. Sir. Look at that thing. Looks like OEM, bro. Right? Look at oh, the yeah. inside. Detail. It's better than oh, OEM. Um, we actually uh, de-riveted the skeleton of the bumper to make sure we get the right perfect lines on the insert because all this stuff was all inserted with our skeleton. So we re literally took out all the rivets, nice. painted everything gloss black, and then we riveted it back to our bumper. Dude, it's like, yeah. like how the factory does it. Yeah. That's sick. So instead of massive tape that. in it, we literally just did it the right way. You guys all. definitely Dude, need to let's work go. Right. But doesn't it look better than OEM though? Look at it, like yeah. the quality. That's what I'm saying. It's tell. crazy. Isn't this place crazy? Look, it's nuts. But unfortunately, you're getting a supercar, though, so sorry. Right. No American cars. Right there. Look. See, I know. <laughs> he, 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 had, he had one back in the oh, day. No way, right? When the hype was, like, really big. Oh, when they first came Yeah, out. yeah. Money on. He sold someone in Dubai. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if Dubai's got dough. Sale, wants it, don't call him, you know? oh, oh, it is? It's for sale? Pro charge, pro charge no way. He's selling it. He has four This owner has two well two carbon ones yes he has four c8s two z06s and two stingrays and oh two are full god. carbon yeah. oh my god i didn't know that last one i just the two carbon yeah, yeah. <laughs> dude he's a madman yeah. he has four c8s four c8s and i don't want to go down the car collection maybe we'll, once we once we get your lambo ready to go here maybe we'll oh, what else has he got what else has he got? got roy's lambos uh he's got uh mclaren's as well he's got a lot he's got a good collection wow yes well i wouldn't be mad if you bought this Right. That's the only way I let you get like an all supercar. If you got this, that that'd be that'd be worth it. This is hard. All carbon, dude. This is dope. All right, we fit. It fit, man. Look at that little angle on there. The seat is low rider in the back, so Mel will be a good pasture princess, and he'll be okay. <laughs> He's either gonna sit back here or sit um, at an angle in the front. But where are you gonna sit, man? You gonna sit back there? Or you gonna low ride it in the, in the back back there? The BMW. Huh? Where are you gonna sit, man? What you gonna do? What's what's your choice? I'll sit back here. You, you sure? Yeah. You can sit back there like the Godfather in the back. Yeah. I can sit like that. You can still lean back. <laughs> you can lean back. Lean back. Lean back. <laughs> lean back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have made it to our destination. Where are we at? San Diego Auto Spas. Where are we at? They are gonna PPF this Technica bumper 
a local spot in here, down here in San Diego. If you guys want to stop by, I'll put the address, link in the description for their Instagram. Check them out, man. I'm be doing some work with these guys. I'm super pumped because they're local. I really want to try and get down to some of my local shops down here, whether it's wrap, maintenance, whatever you want to call it in the car. That's what I'm trying to do is get with more local shops in San Diego because we don't have a lot of them. So I found one through my boy Moab. He hooked me up. He knows the owner very well. And I've seen his work. He does a fantastic job. So I'll be working with him really close. And But let's hop in here and see what they got working, man. Let's see what they got going on here. What is it about these cars that you love so much? Man, Granted, this sorry. spec looks, it looks sick. What is it not? Yeah, what not what like is it? Cause like, I think you guys were just talking earlier, right? You were like, what, what, what was the combination people go from again? You said JDM to what, where they go to? They go from, from my experience, they go from JDM to the new Supra, right? Okay. And then from the new Supra, they bump up to BMWs, and then BMWs final boss, they go to Porsche. The Porsche <laughs> final boss, I like that. Is that what it is for you? Yep. Cause that's the first time I've heard that Eric, Eric Choi told me the same thing. He's like, when BMW owners get a little bit more money, they get a Porsche. He got the GT3 RS. Yep. Why? That's how it is. You gotta get out of it, man. It's just the timeless design, the reliability, it, the speed that it has. Okay, I hear you, I hear you, I hear you. Set all the edges and then we tuck okay. it in so you can't even see it. So this is all sealed right here, but it tucks in. Nice. Right in there. So you're actually fixing the factory PPF. Correct. That's wild. So the owner got this car from the factory PPF. And you're showing us that the edges aren't, what said they weren't, what's the proper term you use? They're not tucked in. Tucked so in, okay. All the seams still show, so it just catches dirt. Oh yeah, you can see so, all that. That's uh, wild. Over time it's gonna look bad too, because uh, what, this eventually it might yellow a little bit, so yeah. it's, you'll see the line and everything. Yeah, what were you saying? No, I was saying you should have seen the one I pulled off, bro. It was just a piece right here. You got uh -huh. you, actually can't see it anymore because I cleaned, but just a piece right here, but all around it was just black. Dude, that up uh, that extra cost in that was probably dude. I'm gonna say low six thousand, low, probably more than that. That they paid extra to have that factory PPF in my car. It wasn't even done right. So now we're here at San Diego Auto Spa to get it fixed. And that's why I brought my bumper here to have it done the right way. I introduce you to you guys, the owner of San Diego Auto Spa, this is Wasim. Hey guys, this is Wasim here. I'm the owner of San Diego Auto Spa. This First time meeting him, right? I know, man. This guy is yeah, this is a big, really, he's a, he's a big guy. That's a bad, let you know. That's a bad dude <laughs> right here. It's a big, it's a big guy that's right here. Right if you do here. something wrong, man, he gonna yeah, knock yeah. you out. I'm no, just saying. Not, not at all. <laughs> You didn't warn me, bro. I walked in up, and I, I, I did not expect that. I walked in, I was like, oh, shoot. No, no. <laughs> it's all love here, brother. I love your shot, brother. Yeah, way. I appreciate it's that. sick. We were talking to the side, and I was, you guys saw the B-rolls I did of all the cars up here on the wall. You did all those cars. Yeah, we did That's all this. Crazy. Yeah, all these cars. It's amazing. We have, you know, we appreciate our clients, their yeah. trust. And we just, you know, go the extra mile making sure, you know, we build the relationship with our yeah. customers. You know, the trust is the most important thing. I mean, of course but, you got trust. You did a La Ferrari. Like, yeah, hey, no one's just dropping off a La Ferrari. As a matter of fact, <laughs> this one is the one of 499. So this is the wow. first edition. Wow. So, yeah. We specialize in, you know, paint protection film. We yeah. do ceramic coatings. We do window tinting, paint corrections right here. So that's what we mainly specialize in. One of the most important things you guys can do to your car. One, you want to protect it, and two, you want to make it look shiny and brand new. Shiny, and the, yeah. the, the, the good thing about the paint protection film is if you don't like the gloss look, you can go with an yes. exact and finish. Dude, we were looking at that earlier, huh? And, 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 and this Ooh. one is a, you know, the original color is the olive green metallic from Mercedes. It's it, crazy it, to it see it only night comes, and day. It only comes on an S-Class or a G-Wagon. Oh, really? By this the color? Way. Yes. Oh, wow. I didn't know that. So this one is getting a full stealth paint protection film. So yeah, it's you can not see the difference. Yet. That's yeah, crazy how you can see, see the gloss. The I like that. Yeah, that's so Dude, completely makes it like way more aggressive and like sinister. I like yeah. it. I can't wait to have my hands on your beautiful, yes. you know, your bumper. Yes. Yeah, I'm can't excited wait. for it. Once I can't wait. Done, I know it's like 50 pieces. Like that. <laughs> now I was telling the audience, man, 19 pieces, you guys. You told me the technic, I'm like, wait a second, man. Is that the one that has like, 30, 40 pieces. <laughs> so yeah, so all individual, right? So I don't know what we're talking like. So this yeah. this will be like a piece, right? Correct. Probably a piece, another piece. This one, yeah. That's this a is, lot of well, work. This, these, Ooh. so this is one piece. This is okay. another piece right here. And this wow. is another piece. This is another piece right wow. here. And then you have two separate pieces right here. Wow. But then, it, you know, the good thing about that is, is you know, it comes with a 10 year warranty. Now you, oh, wow. you had it, you know, painted. And now you want to protect your paint. Yeah. You know, it comes with a 10-year warranty and you don't have 
you drive it worry free yes. knowing that it is 100%. protected you know yeah. that's the most important thing especially yes. th th this is not cheap either no. i mean you know painting it and having it repainted yep. you always want to keep original 100 percent. so you guys once again if you're in the san diego area please come through san diego yeah, so we're, yeah, san diego Spot, very easy to find us online we're very five easy. star rated yeah, uh, but yeah we, I can tell, man. You guys do. We don't, uh, you know, really from, good job. From, from Hondas to Toyotas to Lambos, it, it doesn't. Matter. doesn't we're matter. here at the end of the day. We were generally there to help our customers. Yes. That's all what it is about. 100%. Whether they spend hundred dollars or we have tickets that are twelve thousand, fifteen thousand dollar, we're here to help. Yes. Yeah. I can tell. As soon as I walked in, it's very welcoming. If you guys get angry or something, you can hit those punching bags and let, let some steam out while your car gets done. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when I was working with Wasim, I know how he's very careful and patient, so I was like, this guy's the right job. Mo, Mo, Mo you used good. to work here? Yeah. Oh, so he fired you. Dang! Yeah. That's crazy! <laughs> crazy. <laughs> crazy! No, that's is not... Is that awkward? <laughs> My bad. He was, he was too good. He was too good. I couldn't afford him. Let's put it this way. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> oh, that was a funny joke. That was funny. The best expression was his expression, though. He was like, oh, shoot. We are back at San Diego Auto Spa, baby. Look at this. A little gold in there. Look at Dave. Dave, you got to get the matching wheels like they did. They stepped up their game with the gold rims. We're here to pick up the Technica bumper. It just got PPF. Then also, we have to drive up today, same day, up to Orange County, over to Auto Attic. You guys see the hat? Auto Attic, baby, to get that bumper put on today. So it's gonna be an adventure today, man. And then I have to then take it to PFS to get that little livery back on. Just some small little touches on the side of the bumper that you guys see that's on the stock bumper, right? So it's gonna be an adventure, man, in this video. Like, you guys saw the process of picking it up, dropping it off, now it's PPF, picking it up again, taking the, that, the bumper and the Huracan up to get it installed and then taking it over to PFS and we will get that bumper reveal in this video. I'm so excited. So let's pick this thing up, see what the guys are up to. And man, let's head up and get this thing installed, man. I'm pumped. It's gonna really change how this car looks. I'm telling you, like, it's gonna completely change the aesthetics of this car. And I know you guys are excited, and so am I. Let's do it. have to really appreciate the work and detail in this bumper because I know it was a pain in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> right? You know, know it was uh, definitely was a challenge. Most of the panels, they had the pre-cut and obviously we extend everything so everything is beautifully tucked in. Dude, you won't this. see any seams. But unfortunately, there were certain parts that they didn't have a template for it. So yeah. I had to spend some time creating my own template. Yeah. I know we had talked before that the car yeah, is so new. So, I was kind of a little concerned about the, the template thing. Yeah, but it was, overall, it was what? Mean, this part, right? This uh, part? No, didn't have it a was, as a matter of fact, it was this part right here. Oh, that's this right. It's all done in one piece, and then also this inside right here as well. That's all done in one crazy. piece. Crazy. So this is all one. This is all one piece. Wow. Yeah. So it's doable, but you just yeah. have to know where to cut, where to do the, you know, your cutting. You gotta be good at your job. <laughs> Guys, please give them a follow on Instagram, sending out a spa. Any work you need, come from anywhere, they will hook you up I appreciate and that. do a really good job. Like, I'm once again, I'm blown away at the work because this bumper, you guys, look at all the curves, all the divots. Yeah, this is all PPF. Everything, Everything is PPF. It's it came out beautiful. That's not, that's and, and, it's and not as a matter of fact, I had to cut this one twice because the original one, the template, uh -huh. it was off about half an inch. Oh, wow. So I didn't like, first when I put it on, I didn't like the way yeah. it looked because again, I didn't want the visible seams to show. Yeah. yeah. So I, I resized everything and everything is hand cut. I Look mean, if you really go in there, it's all the way in there. You won't see like exposed seams. No, you can't see, right I'm literally zoomed all the way there, in. You it's, can't it's, see uh, nothing. Yeah, that's Dude, it's such an amazing the, job. You know, I, mean, I appreciate your good. trust. Uh, no, you know, I appreciate that you. Means, uh, a lot to me, you know. Nah, man, you, uh, dude, you killed it. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. We will be back. Before I leave, I was outside just talking to Watson about like mobile detailing. I saw his van outside. You guys saw all the gold. He used to do mobile detailing. I used to do mobile detailing. That's how I started. He's showing me his uh, van that he started in from the bottom, from scratch. Bam. <laughs> this is awesome. And just like this, huh? 
I swear to God, just like and that. If you guys don't believe us, look at he still has it. San Diego Mobile Details. Okay. The story you told me before, you said you started from scratch at 250. Within uh, two years. Two years, okay. Like 200 five star reviews. Wow. Just on Yelp. That's crazy. Uh, I worked like, you know, so hard to, you know, build the clientele. I was washing cars for like 30 bucks, driving all the way to San Isidro from Poway. Wow. Just That's my the drive. gas was like 15 bucks. Hey. But I did it just to build yeah. you know, the reputation, the yeah. name. That's what That's the, the, you know, the success is coming from San Diego Mobile That's Vita awesome. and hard work. You know? I love it. And believing in yourself, yeah. obviously. So he'd pull, guys, he'd pull up. Imagine would, if you saw this van pull up, you're like, I'm about to pay this person to detail my car. Yeah, but like, then, but then know, they saw the final product. And that's, they're blown away. That's all what it was about. Yeah. You know, I wanted to yeah. show them that it's not about somebody showing up with a fancy car. Yep. And that means that their work is, you it's know, good. good. Yep. So I 100%. showed them the opposite, saying, hey, yeah. don't, you know, don't judge a book by its cover. Yes, yes. Uh, well, the one thing I like is obviously the grind determination, but it's like being prepared for the moment. Seriously. 100%. I feel like we all get moments. Some of us will get two or three. You may only get one, but you got to be ready for it because when you get it, you got to shine, and then it starts Absolutely. rolling forward and rolling forward. You're prepared with like, you knew what you were doing. You're going to do a really good job. You took time and she did a good job. So regardless of what the cover of the book looked like, correct. when they got the story, they were blown don't, away. Don't judge, yeah. correct. And this is an inspiration for myself. That's awesome. Every day when I walk in, open up the shop, that's I look awesome. at this and I, you know, understand Dude, that's awesome. where I came coming from, you know? That's and then it. I have still have my carpet extractor. Everything is inside. Really? Yeah, like like <laughs> literally. If you go inside, everything is still inside. Oh my gosh! And you know uh, another funny awesome. thing about this is uh, the transmission. It's like you can't put it on drive and start driving. You have to put it on manual, like two. Okay. And that's when it starts driving. And then you kick it and in drive it. <laughs> I I've love been driving it. it for like three years like that. I love right. it. So then I open up my shop yeah. and then, you know, things are rolling now. It and now we do PPF and, you know, yeah. you saw the van, the other Mercedes van. So yeah. I strictly use that for promo advertising. Yeah. I, lo I love the beginning stories, man. It's like you have an idea, you roll with it, we you trust yourself. Somewhere. Exactly. Yes. Here we are, guys. It is about to go down. I am super stuck. We were getting fancy lights set up and everything, but we're gonna get this Technica bumper on this car finally. And then we still have to tomorrow head over to PFS to get that little mini livery back on. So these little, not much, nothing crazy, right? But we still gotta get this back on the car to keep this livery popping and going. And then we're gonna keep rolling, man. And then update, wing should be on the way. They're waiting for, it wasn't uprights. No, last video I said uprights. It wasn't uprights they're waiting for. They're waiting for the rear deck lid where the ring's going into is full carbon fiber. I did not know that. I thought I was gonna use my deck lid and have to cut some holes in it. And is like, nah, skinny, we're not doing that. You're not cutting anything stock. We're gonna give you a carbon fiber deck lid. So it's gonna be a carbon wing, carbon deck lid, and it's gonna look killer. So hopefully that'll get done next week, but I have a nice, big, huge wing. I saw pictures and video. It's huge, and hopefully the rims also will be arriving. So we have two goodies arriving for the Huracan once after this Technica bumper gets on. So things are in motion, guys, and I'm super pumped and excited, man. Like, I love when these things start to piece together, and when it all aligns, it's gonna look killer. You guys are gonna love the transformation. I still have a lot more things in store for this car, and you might need to get a front splitter, still need to get side skirts. Also, I'm doing some scanning of the car, and I'm gonna completely transform the whole outside body of this car with my boys over here at Auto Attic. I don't want to reveal too much, but we have a lot more things coming for this car. But right now, but front bumper, I'm gonna take it out of this car. We have the wing coming and we have the rims coming on the way too. So man, hang on tight, man. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe to the channel, trust me. You're not going to miss what we have coming up. Hope you guys want to come along for the ride. Let's get this bumper out.
up and the bumper is going on. Dang. I know, I know, I know. I know. I snake you guys. I apologize, but not a full apology. I cannot show you this bumper without putting this little livery back on, although it's not much of the livery that is off and it's going back on, but I gotta give you the full picture. I pull up the PFS right now. We're gonna pull it back, get this stuff on here, and reveal what this thing looks like. Because <laughs> it looks freaking sexy. All right, we are going to the back, baby. I am super excited for you guys to see what this thing looks like. It looks so aggressive and so hard. Yes, I know you can look at a Technica and see what it looks like, but it has a different element because obviously my car has different body lines than the Technica, especially that rear engine bay, which to me, I like my style engine bay better and it gives it a different look, man. So we're pulling in, baby. Look, these guys are hard at work all the time here. Oh, snap. Oh, Here's trouble. You see the front? Love it. You like it, Bob? Let's go. This guy's getting it in right now. I always wondered how this process worked. Soft hands, I look at them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, you see this piece right here? Look at them soft. <laughs> <laughs> like buttery soft, like massage type soft. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Man, look at that. Yeah, he looks, see how rough he is? You, you smooth, you smooth with the brush. I'm brother smooth. <laughs> Time has come. Let's get to this bumper reveal right now. This thing looks so aggressive. Without further ado, let's go. The Auto Addict Technica style front bumper on a 2017 Huracan 580-2. And lunch is here. Let's get it. Oh, bam, what do you guys think? This thing turned out crazy. It is killer. Oh my gosh, it's nuts. It looks completely different, obviously, off the bumper, right? When I first received it, wasn't painting it raw, it was black. Then we got the paint, you guys saw that process. The paint came out so amazing, so amazing. And then I got a PPF by San Diego Auto Spa down in San Diego. Gave it that extra shine and protection that it needed. And now it actually on the car, holy smokes. It literally completely transformed the way this car looks. And now PFS hooked your boy up, obviously, by getting that little livery back on here. They also helped me out and covered up the sensors. These sensors come painted the Verde Mantis, obviously, to match, right? Because remember, the old bumper was Verde Mantis all the way through here. So they got me some dots covered up. Now they're all blacked out to match. And it just looks so menacing. Look how aggressive it looks, literally. Like, I'm telling you, this little slant right here that the Technic came out with makes these headlights look more slanted and more pissed off and aggressive. And that's what I love about it. Freaking came out so good. And so if you guys have a Huracan of any platform, doesn't matter if it's a 580, 610, if you want this bumper, hit up my boys over at Auto Addict. Link's in the description. Hit them up, contact my boy Mo, whoever, they'll help you out. And um, guys, get this bumper, and it's a really good price. The price tag is not that bad. Like, I'm gonna tell you, it's a good, probably 60 to 70% cheaper than most bumpers you'll get from other manufacturers. Like. Really good price point and it completely changes the way your car looks. And here's what I love about this bumper with my car. So yes, I know, and you guys are gonna say it like, it's a Technica front bumper like a Technica. Yes, it's like a Technica, right? But one thing I don't like about the Technica, just my opinion, my opinion, I don't like the rear engine bay. I don't like how it has the flat look on the rear engine bay because it has that Gallardo look. I really love when Lamborghini came out with the Huracan platform and they added that aggressive like slope to the back end because it also went with the front. If you look at the angles, it has that front slope also on the windshield to the hood of the car, and I like how it gives that aggressive look. That's what I love about this platform, specifically on this, these Huracons, right, before you went to the Technica. So adding that element of the front end with the rear end that I like, it really just changes the game. I freaking love how this came out. Look at this thing. Holy smoke. It is so aggressive. And guys, I'm not done yet. I still have rims coming. I have the 1016 wing, which is, man, 
talk to James that it is a little bit over, over six feet wide. I'm not kidding you. That means that wing is gonna go, see where this one went, right? It goes right here. It's probably gonna go all the way to about the edge, about the edge of the fender right here. That's how big, so look at this, this wing. It's gonna go to the edge of each fender. That's how wide the new wing is. So hang on tight, it's gonna be amazing when it comes. And I mentioned also before that the deck lid is also gonna be carbon fiber. So it'll be carbon fiber wing, upright, carbon fiber deck lid right here and the wing's gonna be tilted and spot a little bit over six feet wide. I had things in motion. Thank you guys for being patient. Thank you guys for following along. Hope you're enjoying this journey because man, I'm loving it and it looks wow. Just take another look. Look at this thing. <laughs> Holy smokes. Oh, not over yet. Woo! <laughs> Visitor, what's up, man? What's up, dude? Hey, what, 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 you notice anything new in the, in the car? Go look at the front, go look at the front. I wanna see his reaction. Whoa. Yeah! <laughs> hey, 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 Yo. You like that? Hey, that's dope. You like that? Let's go, baby, let me park this thing. Let's go. Hell yeah. All right, let's talk about this thing, man. Killed it, huh? They murked that thing, man. They killed it. Yeah, I hope you guys love this Auto Attic Technica style front bumper. Like, I couldn't just end the video like that. You guys, I had to give you guys a better live view of what this thing looks like. Like, look at this. Look how freaking aggressive that is. Like, look at that. Yo, completely changed the whole front of this car. Like, the way the gloss black contrasts yeah. with the green. Dude, isn't that sick? That's crazy. Like, hey, I have to, I have to keep bragging about my own car. It looks hard. I'm not gonna lie, it looks hard. And we're not done, we're not done yet. I have, I haven't showed you yet. I have a huge wing, six <laughs> feet wide. I'm gonna sit like right here, dude. It's six feet wide. Have I shown you the new rims? You haven't. Oh, okay, I'm gonna show, I'm gonna show you the joints. Oh, those are Fire, sick, fire, yep. let's go. And I have some other goodies that I haven't told you guys about, but I'm gonna wait. I'm not gonna tell you everything. But I have two other things that are coming on this car pretty soon. I can also change up this car a little bit. But I have a lot going, guys. So we have the bumper, I got the wing, I got the rims, and working on side skirts. With Auto Act, I'm also working on another splitter to extend this more. It's already looks like it's extended because it has that double air, but I'm gonna get another one that comes out a few inches here and add that more aggressiveness on the front end. But dude, this thing looks killer. So please give Auto Act a follow, guys. The link is in the description. If you guys have any American cars, like Mustangs, Camaros, Corvettes, they have you guys covered on all things carbon fiber, doors, hoods, full wide body kits, wings, side skirts, splitters, and you have a Huracan. You can get this Technica style bumper. They will hook you up. Let them know Skinny sent you. Killed it. Like, look at the lines. Like, look at, there's no gaps. Look at this. That is like stock, better than stock freaking fitment. It is freaking money. Look at this. And last but not least, San Diego Auto Spa, you guys, hit them up. Anything clear bra, you just want to wash your car, make it shiny, paint correction. While well, Sam, he's the owner, he is a master, I'm telling you. But his quality and attention to detail is freaking amazing. And his communication is A1. So if you're in Orange County area, it's not far from you. Anywhere near Northern San Diego for Orange County or in San Diego, hit him up. Links in the description. I'm telling you, he will set you straight. Tell him Skinny sent you and he will honestly give you a crazy, crazy hookup. And man, even if you have motorcycles, right? You gotta hit him up. He will wax clay bra and make your paint look brand new. Even PPF your bike if you want. Oh yeah. Kills it, man. He can even honestly add some coating on your rims so you don't get all the brake dust. I know you get brake dust. I, right, look, a look, lot. look at it right now. Look at it. You got brake dust on it right now, man. Look at look, 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 look this thing. Oh, no bueno. <laughs> no bueno, man. But what do you guys think? I hope you guys love this. Once again, it's just the beginning. I told you guys when I got this car, I have ideas, I have projects. It's gonna take time, but it's all gonna be worth it. And this is really stage, I would say stage one, man. Stage one of the process of building this car. And when you see the other stuff coming, it's really gonna completely transform this thing. It's gonna be like no other Huracan you've seen before with the splash of skinny, baby. Yeah. Skinnyism, just sex. Skinny, whoa!